Honorable Joachim Henry, Minister for Equity, Social Justice and Empowerment of St. Lucia, delivered a compelling statement at a major event held at the United Nations World Food Programme WFP headquarters in Rome, Italy, shedding light on the pressing challenges faced by small island developing states, SIDS. The event, dubbed WFP in SIDS, Perspectives from the Caribbean and the Pacific, took place on February 27 and brought together stakeholders to address specific vulnerabilities of SIDS in the face of climate change and poverty. The panel discussion is one of the events leading up to the 4th International Conference on Small Island Developing States, scheduled for May 2024 in Antigua and Barbuda. Minister Henry emphasized the daunting task of recovering from recurrent weather systems, describing it as battling the war of climate change and weathering systems year after year. He highlighted St. Lucia's critical vulnerability due to its size, noting that a single weather event could devastate the entire island leaving its population without means of adaptation. With 25% of St. Lucia's population below the poverty line and an additional 25% approximately at the risk of falling into poverty, in the event of shock, our country, St. Lucia, is quite susceptible despite being labeled a middle-income country. This is why we need to put systems in place to ensure that we help our people overcome generational poverty. Phenomena like natural disasters could erode the hard-earned gains and force individuals and communities to start over from scratch. There is also the negative effect of the global financial system on the poor as financial pressures and restrictions imposed by global financial system in the people accessing banking services and thus perpetuate a cycle of poverty. All of this underscores the urgent need for a collective action to address the intersecting challenges of climate change and poverty. In addition to his participation in the event, Minister Henry engaged in discussions with Cindy McCain, Executive Director of WFP, emphasizing the need for enhanced collaboration and support for SIDS. The dialogue highlighted the significance of addressing the unique needs of vulnerable populations in St. Lucia, including single mothers caring for chronically disabled children. Minister Henry expressed appreciation for WFP's impactful work in St. Lucia, emphasizing its tangible investment in the lives of vulnerable households. Minister Henry's continued advocacy represents St. Lucia's unwavering commitment to uplifting its most vulnerable citizens and fostering a more resilient society.